Alright guys, welcome back to the episode of Lord of the Craft, episode 2 today guys. Anyway, this is the king here, this is the king of the town I am currently living in, which is the main dwarven town I believe here in Lord of the Craft. Anyway, this guy's taking me to see a house that, um, I don't remember what you have to do to get, to, um, gain a house here, but I'm willing to do whatever it takes, because, uh, it's not going to cost money, and it's just going to work out a lot better in the end. So he's showing me to an area, uh, we've appeared to stop here, but, um, a lot of members drawn on it. I like a lot of dwarfs, and has uh, like over 100 people on the server now. So that's awesome. I love um when a lot of people join. You have to join the guild. Okay, that's fine. All right, so right here we get ourselves a house possibly, and uh, it's a little small. We can make it bigger. Okay, so I'll get back to you guys when um uh, we get the stuff figured out. Alrighty guys, welcome back to some more Lord of the Craft. Anyway, I got really like settled very nicely so far. Uh, I met the king as you guys seen beforehand. His name is Balik, and uh, he set me up here with. Uh, he gave. He told me to add. Uh, um, he told Skippy. To, uh, I believe his last name is Iron Dead as well to add me to the door to go to the mines. And uh, that's very awesome. And I also got a house, guys. Believe it or not, or at least a small house for now. I'm gonna be working on purchasing another house when I'm. Um, I've, I'm gonna try to ride around town and see what I can sell. So that's the plan. And anyway, this is yep, this is my house right here for now. And the, the chest is also locked. So I'm gonna transport all my stuff right now. Then we have to go on a we're gonna go on a mining trip because of the fact that I want to try and get um as you know as much resources as I possibly can. So it's I'm pretty I'm pretty stoked right now, and uh, I want to try to meet the quota. So I have let's see I want to be really I want to be like be, you know be completely realistic about this. So we have till March 18th. So to 25th, so that's like we have a uh, seven days. So to the 25th, um, uh, next Wednesday I should have my quota met, and if not, I will lose my house. But anyway, if you guys remember uh, the start screen of last episode, this is where it actually was taking place. Was this room right here? And uh, they ended up clearing out very nicely, so that's awesome. Uh, right now, we're gonna go to our Legion barracks, which is over here. I'm glad I'm memorizing this place, and uh, let's grab out our stuff and transport it to our locked chest and uh, we're gonna take this sign off the sign off the off the bunk bed and let's move on to our house again hopefully we can remember where it's at I no it's this way I'm pretty sure yep okay oh uh, there's something else is yeah okay, I told you there's a lot of people online there's something else there's another person there's the king of there's so many people online right now I love it it's, it's, it's awesome when there's a bunch of people playing. Uh, I'm going the wrong way, I believe. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm going the wrong way. Uh, <clears throat> Watch, I just forget where my house was. Oh my gosh, that's actually very possible at this point. I cannot remember. Oh, it's in here. It's in here for sure. I'm pretty sure it's in here. Yeah, I remember this now. Oh no, I don't want to hit the minecart and it's going the other direction. Okay. Oh, that's just what has to happen, I guess. But anyway, that's something else right there. Okay, that guy, that guy actually gave me food, so shout out to that guy. Thank you, dude. You saved my life. Uh, here we are, let's go here, go up the stairs, and, uh, go to our house, and where this is ours, we're gonna stick this here, and we're gonna keep the mining walls, just in case we need them, but for now we don't, and I think we're good for now, I honestly do, um, let's see, what's all this? Oh, Hobo, that guy that, uh, the king actually is part of the event team, I guess, that's very cool. They're probably all the kings that are part of the event team, that actually makes sense now. That guy got his quota done, so nice. Uh, my quota still needs to be met, so I'm going to go work on that right now. He has a piece of bread and it just expires in two days. Okay. Um. Let's actually try to find a forest right now. Before we go down, I would like to get some wood, so let's go out and try to find some trees to cut down. Alrighty guys, so right now we just went to the lumber yard. If you guys uh you guys didn't see this part, but I did end up finding the lumber yard accidentally. I wasn't looking for it, just looking around. I did not top this tree down, I swear to god I did not do that. But I may wait, it, sh it just was recently chopped down because there's no logs in it and it's disappearing. I did not do that, I seriously did not. Uh but anyway, quota chest below. This is on the lumber yard. I don't know what the quota is for uh this. So what I'm gonna decide to do is I'm gonna drop I'll drop six logs maybe in that um little area after I get fit. I should have crafted the workstation now. But anyway, I'm crafting a furnace and uh, as we wait for the furnace, we're going to um, be cutting some trees down with our fist, I guess. And the plan this episode, guys, is to go mining and hopefully get our mining skill up and meet our quota halfway and maybe even look around some more. It's the plan so far and then I want to get a uh, farming skill up definitely next episode because farming is the main thing I want to do. 
I don't know why, I don't know why. Something about farming just it sounds fun to me, so. And the leaves will automatically actually don't they won't disappear because they're touching another tree, so I'm about to destroy them. But that's not a big deal. And uh, anyway, you're gonna grab our furnace out here soon. Items finished, okay. What is it? Okay, claim item. There we go. I think we got yep, there it is. Okay. So we got ourselves a furnace now. And um put some of that in there we gotta melt this because we gotta make uh, an, the next crafting station which is like uh, what is it called a workstation is called a mason masonry block and it's for st stonework chase st stone workstation chisel chiseling and modifying stones so that's for like stone tools and stuff and uh, iron tools I believe iron and diamond tools I believe are their anvils so they're gonna be a little harder to make but that's alright we can get them we'll get it eventually and uh Right, so right now we're just waiting for stone to melt. How do we make a chisel? We need mechanisms, we need... That's not a chisel, okay. Uh, not there again, I mean to go to... Not staffs, what is this? Hmm, walking sticks, that actually seems pretty cool. We might do that, we'll see how that is. Oh, we need a depth, we're not anywhere close to that. So we're gonna have to wait. And let's see, building... I need... Where will parts here, I think this is it. Okay, so chisel, we need one cobblestone and one stick. We can start crafting that. No, we cannot. Why can't we? Oh, no, no. There goes all the cobblestone. And the server is restarting. Okay. Well, guys, I'll get back to you when I'm... Um... Alrighty, guys. So we got a fair amount of wood. Oh, I almost forgot to fill that guy's quota chest. I just realized that. And now we're going to take us our take our wood back to our house and probably start mining. So I don't know how much he wants. I'm just going to leave this in there. And we'll drop 16 to make it a, like, you know, like a Minecraft. At 17, I want just one more. A Minecraft, uh, even, like, you know, like, things that go in 16, 32, 48, 64. Uh, stuff like that, I don't know. This is how it usually is counted, in my opinion. But I uh, hope I didn't ruin any of his seeds. I don't think I did. Okay, but anyway, I gotta try to find my way back here. I, I think I found it. And, um, yeah, so this is the lumber farm. I know where this is now. And, uh... Or tree cutting farm, I'm not, I'm not sure we would like to call this. Actually, used to do the camps for I just realized. But I always do camps for that lightning was super loud. I don't know why. Or thunder, I mean, not lightning. Okay, so I think we're going back to Dwarven, or like our origin area. Okay, I just set that down. Let's get that out of there. And, um, something we also need before we go down is some more food. So, let's see, what can we do? Cheapest thing got some the land. Okay, we got what is this, a tavern? I actually have some money too now, guys. And uh, the money I have, well, I have a hundred minas. I didn't even realize. So I have a hundred minas, guys. I can probably buy some food, I'd imagine, somewhere. And that's pretty, that's pretty helpful, you would imagine. So hopefully we can try to find an area to buy some food. We got a lot of furnaces in here, to say the least. Did we? We didn't pick up. Our, yeah, we did. Okay. Oh, yeah, we did. Okay, I was gonna say, we did not pick them up. That would suck so bad. We should definitely go back and get them. But, uh, I cannot find where you could buy some food at. So, we're gonna try to find some food and we'll go down to the mines. I think I just seen somebody. Yep, somebody's right there. Okay. Okay, so I'm getting a little bit of spikes. So, hold up. Forward to the Grand Kingdom of Ergon. So, this is the way we, I guess, the way we should go. I believe this is where I'm living. I think that's what it's called. I, I know I I forget the names of the places I live. Yeah, this is it for sure. It's the nicest looking one. Well, that's like one only I've seen. I gotta do some exploring one episode. Well, guys, one episode, probably episode five, maybe. I wanna just explore. That's all I wanna do is just literally walk around, explore, see if there's see. I think that'd be a fun episode just to literally just explore. But oh, that's right, we're not in the Legion barracks anymore. We're actually have our own house, so we're actually doing decent. And uh, I think that was huge grand axe. There's the king right there. I believe without him. Yeah, so that's the king of Ergon. I think I believe that's how you pronounce it, Ergon. And uh, hopefully, there's Skippy. He probably added me at the door by now. Oh, nope, he still has not done that. Or maybe he has. He just hasn't took the sign off yet. We'll have to wait and see, I guess. And let's go back to my house. And we'll drop some stuff off here. We have pine cones, pine cones. Why can't they go together? There we go. Okay, we're gonna keep the apples because that's the only source of food we have. I just remember we got them, luckily. And I'll put saplings in here. I'm gonna keep this. We're gonna keep the furnace. We'll put the furnace down in here. And. Alrighty, I think we're good to go. I mean, we'll uh, put some wood in here as well. We don't wanna bring too much of that with us just in case we were to somehow die. You know, we gotta be more safe. We gotta be safe on the safe side for sure. 
I know that's about it guys so we can put this away we'll put this way this and that will keep that much wood just in case we need it I don't think we will and let's, so let's go down to the mines and hopefully we'll be added to the door so I don't have to break through it he told me I could break through it but I want to yaw or just um just legit go through the door what is this never been down here holding cell oh this is actually like a jail cell they actually are building jail cells it appears for people that um disobeyed the rules I would imagine which I don't know why you do oh they actually have a bunch of anvils here too a bunch of them a bunch of anvils okay yep the door is still locked uh, let's give him a punch see if he's here um I guess not okay so we're out to break through the door sorry I didn't want to do this but um I'm not gonna break through that door because I don't know actually probably won't even let me do it anyway so let's just do it let's break through the iron bars sorry I did not I don't want to do this but I have to I think I'll actually break through two. Oh, I'm not about to break through four. Okay, so break that one and this one, and we are to the mines. So he told me I could do this, guys. So don't think I'm just you know a disobeying role play. I was actually told I was able to do this by the king. So here we are. Okay, so I'm gonna do a couple minutes of mining with you guys, and I'll take you. I'll just like you know like throw you ahead to where uh I'll throw you ahead to when I get finally finished mining. And where should we go? Which way should we go? I don't wanna what happens if you get trapped in the mines? Like what happens? I think you can do slash you do slash SS. And oh god, okay. A zombie right away. Throw him off. And I heard another one I believe. Uh so let's try to get the cords. Can we get is there cords? Okay. So seven hundred and eight sixty or we'll say seven hundred and eight seventy is where we need to be back to. And the Y is 109, so let's try to get, let's go down just a bit here. We're gonna go down uh, this, toward this direction, and hopefully, I don't think I want to go all the way. And anyway, we're gonna go all the way down this way. Why not? We'll start digging down this direction here. Okay, so I'm very excited, guys, to start mining because I need to meet the quota. That's something I want to do. You know, I want to make sure I pay my debts to the um, Oregon, Oregon community to make sure that oh, we dug in someone else's mine. Oops. So I make sure that we don't, I meet the, meet the standards, you know, to live there for free. Because I am living there for free. I just need to make sure I get that stuff in. Which is, uh, you know, I can, I can do that. I would imagine I don't see a problem with that. And, um, okay, so I think it's 768 is what it was. So I still remember. I hear a skeleton right now, actually. So I always try to dig toward him. You got to make sure you leave these. Make sure you have the mine supported, too. You don't want to get the fall in on you. Okay. So here we are. I hear that skeleton somewhere. I know he has to be chilling just somewhere around the corner, probably. And I really want to find some coal. It sounds weird, you know. Usually you're not looking for coal, but to meet the quota, definitely down to find some coal right now. Uh, here we go. Actually, I don't think I need one. Yeah, I don't need one here. Put that there. And let's see. Where's that skeleton? I'll see if we can find it. I'm sure, we probably will. Okay. Keep mining, and we're gonna stick some more walls down. I'm doing it right here as well. Let's see, is he down this way? I hear him better and better every time I go down more. Okay. And then we're gonna start shifting our mind toward this direction. So we're gonna take the cobblestone, go like that, and uh, <clears throat> we're gonna make sure it's held up right here, just to make it to be safe. And we're gonna go down with a two by two mine. Hey guys, I will probably I'll end up getting back to you when I find some iron or coal, or maybe just after the trip I'll decide uh, which is the best because I don't want to waste you guys' time to watch me mine. So Alrighty, guys. So I wanted to show you guys this because I ended up finding some iron. That's awesome. So right here we have three, four, five, six. It looks like seven. We found seven iron. Oh eight, eight. Nice. Okay. So we are nine. Awesome. Air skeleton two. So we probably can drop into that cave. And I uh, guess this is actually not very far off my mind to be honest. I mean, it was just like you know down that area. So this is just right over here, and I felt like just stay in that direction. And we end up finding nine iron. Beautiful. Okay, so we're gonna be close. We're like, I think yeah, we're a little over a quarter way there, meeting the iron quota per week. So that's good. And uh, you know that's always a good thing. You want to make sure you pay your debts. Uh, all my stuff. Okay, uh, let's say all my stuff has disappeared. I'm freaking out. But um. I need to make another pickaxe, so hold up. So guys, I'll be back. I'll be back when I completely finish my mining trip.
Alrighty guys, welcome back. I tried and I managed to oh, I seen some stuff over there going on, but uh, anyway, I tried to manage to get a little more uh, resources, but I didn't get as much as I wanted. Because mining in Lord of the Craft, it seems it's a lot harder than just mining in normal Minecraft. Because I only managed to get 23 coal and 9 iron, so I'm pretty sure that spawn rates for minerals are definitely down by quite a lot compared to normal vanilla Minecraft, but that's fine because it's more realistic. You're not going to find iron every 10 blocks like normal vanilla Minecraft, so very cool. Uh, anyway though, let's melt some of this iron right now, and we're not going to use coal because we need to keep the coal, so we'll use some wood. And we'll split it up, and uh, we also improved our skill as a miner, I didn't even mean to, but uh, we are at, let's see, SK list, oh that's right there, already had it pulled up, but anyway, you guys can see we're a clumsy miner, I raised it twice, I leveled it twice, I didn't mean to, I just was just mining, I've been mining for a long time, uh, yep, but anyway, it's pretty crazy guys, so I'll get back to you when everything's melted. Alrighty guys, we are back to our house. Anyway, if you guys can see, we ended up getting 23 coal and 9 iron. The quota being 64 coal and 32 iron, so we'll get some more. Eventually, I might just hop on when I'm not recording and get some to finish it up. For now, I'm going to keep it in this chest until I end up managing to get the right amount. And I'm wondering what I can do with these pine cones or apples. It says pine cones, so I'm going to look up on the wiki eventually what I can do with it because I'm really am wondering. And uh, I think it's going to be the end of the episode, guys, so I don't see much else to do right now. And um, we, we actually we covered a lot. We really did. We did, we did end up covering quite a lot, so it's very good. Uh, if you guys did enjoy this episode of Lord of the Craft, please do hit that like button. I appreciate it very much, guys. And uh, I remember Lord of the Craft, you just come out every Tuesday and Thursday, and I believe I might start uploading them Saturday, too, as a double upload. We'll have to wait and see how that goes, uh, depending on what I am doing Saturday. But, yep, thanks for watching, guys. Have a great day. Come join Lord of the Craft if you haven't yet. It's a great server for medieval roleplay if that's what you're into. As much as I am, at least. Thanks for watching, and see ya.